This is Demented. Let's check it out. This is a very pretty game. I believe it's actually made in Unity. Actually, I know it's made in Unity. And Unity has been impressing the hell out of me lately. It's got some good stuff for graphics. Oh, am I moving? WASD to move, spacebar to jump, T for the GUI, E to interact, sanity pills, heal. Wow, that's a lot of buttons. V for health for sanity, and radiation pills. Now, radiation is supposed to be a pretty key aspect of this. Wow, the movement is really, like, first person like. I mean, your head is actually bobbing in ways a lot of games don't do it, so that's pretty cool. Uh, I can't tell if there's anything in there, it's too dark. I am very much naked, aren't I? Ooh, is that a robo hand? That's a robo hand. That's pretty sick. Alright, I got a key card. A battery. Wow, that is like the first time I've seen a computer in a game that actually looks like a real computer. I don't know if that's because people run into copyright issues with Windows or something, but it's kind of cool to see that. What is that? Battery? I can't look that far down, but I can grab that. There we go. E to interact with the door. Anything else I want before I leave? Big old blood splatter. Any clothes? Nope, I'm going nude. Uh, there we go. I do like the first person feel here where I can actually see my own body. That's always something I've liked in games. I can't seem to move much faster than this though. What the heck? Denise. So let's see, there's a gooey here. Okay, here we go. My health is not doing good. I should probably try to heal. Don't have any health packs. The sound design is pretty top-notch here. I'm liking the whole industrial feel of everything broken and everything. I'm guessing this won't go up, will it? No, that's pretty malfunctioned. Sanity is low. Press Q to take pills. Or exchange health for sanity. I don't have any sanity pills. How do I know what my sanity's at? Oh, there it is. Like, 19... Oh, wow, so actually looking... Actually looking at, like, bad things. It looks like it drives up my sanity. I'm going to keep the gooey up for a while. So my sanity is going down right now. Let's see how that, how that stays. That is not going to help the sanity, is it? Oh, nope. That's a big no. Oh, wow. My sanity is actually going down, so I guess up is good. Up sanity is good. I am not well. Okay, maybe I should try exchanging some sanity? Too low on health. Holy crap. Find an exit. Wow, I am like at no sanity. I can barely jump or move or anything right now. I'm supposed to try to go to the door, right? So I'm supposed to go left and go for the door? Is that the door? I'm upside down now, so... Demented. Wow. So did I just die? No. That's actually part of the game. So far, in terms of atmosphere, this game's pretty top-notch on what you'd uh, hope for it to be. Bad dream? Bad dream. What the... Is that my flashlight? Oh, that's cool. The percentage being right on it. Game mechanics. Sanity. Sanity is one of the key elements of this game. It is located at the far bottom left corner while the GUI is active. Sanity is the core of the demented world as it impacts the world hugely. The less less sanity you have, the more critters and side effects will Bennett have. If you were to reach 0% sanity, you will die, as the tumor has full control. So keep finding sanity pills, press Q to drink them, and to view the GUI, press T. Side effects, less vision, more critters, world changing, slower movement, decrease in FOV, and more. So I feel like all of this can be taught in a better way than just through that menu. Uh, I, I feel like you could definitely teach that way better through actual game mechanics, but I feel like just because of the state the game is in right now, we're just not quite there with that. So this is my flashlight or what? It looks like a flashlight, but it doesn't really... There we go. Gotta press F. I'm liking the look of that, actually. Read this. Bennett, that is what your tag said about you. 
Anyway, I didn't have time. Didn't had time. I had to put you here and lock you. Something is wrong here, and I cannot carry you anymore. I left you in this office for safety. There is a key card in the third drawer. Exit the room. I wish you luck. To exit the room, I wish you luck. Okay, so I feel like during that whole reading scene, it'd be nice if uh, my sanity weren't going down, because I'm not the fastest reader, at least not out loud. By the AOTF administration. Also, I'm noticing that the highlighting is actually going over the the, uh, the text. That's a little rough. Definitely a little bug. All right. Of the facility, all personnel are ordered to leave now. Do not stay in the offices or anywhere. Leave while you can. What do we have in here? Anything helpful? Sanity pills. All right. I'm going to need those. Is that locked? Yeah, it's locked. All right, so I need the key card, right? Where did he say it was? Probably should have read that. I do like how I can actually open up every single drawer. That is a nice little thing. A little nice attention to detail, instead of just one drawer being openable. So this game is very much going to base itself around being, uh, like, r having realistic reactions, it seems. And I like that. I like that a lot. So, I can exchange health for sanity, but if my sanity hits zero, then I die. But if my health hits zero, then I die. So, sounds like sanity is more important uh, to keep up, I guess. So, I'll be exchanging health a lot for sanity. Loving the sound design. I need to just, again, emphasize that. The heck is beeping? I honestly can't tell what's beeping over here. Fire alarm of some sort? You know, minus the fire. The security system is online. I cannot restore it as I need three circuits, four VRAM, green glowy things, and two fuse boxes. Oh, I'm running low on sand. I should probably take my pills. Alright, so there's no animation or anything. You just take the pills and then it's done. Uh, let's see. So I need batteries, fuse boxes, VRAM, uh, master key card. Probably just leave it. Okay. So I gotta go search for this stuff. The thing is, I don't have a lot of time to read, because the more I read, the more my sanity goes down, the quicker I die. It's a bit of a dilemma, really. The lighting is really grim in this game. Okay, what's around here? This place looks familiar. So I, I think my sanity is dropping quicker in here. I'm not really keeping a close gauge on it. I can sprint. Okay, that's good. Uh, I can't really use that tablet, though. No pills. Need my fix. Maybe those pills will help. I'll just take them now, because why wouldn't I? Now, I don't know if there's any kind of overdosing you can do. Like, if you take too many sanity pills, you just die. That might be an interesting mechanic. So it kind of balances you out, so you can't just be chugging on sanity the whole time. You gotta be very careful with it, you know? If that's not a feature, that'd be a pretty cool feature, in my opinion. Balancing yourself out. I think I'm just a sucker for glow glowing things, but I do love the look of this game. Ooh, what have we here? How do I crouch? Is the yep, C. I am ha so I am noticing I'm having trouble grabbing things that are like at my feet. You might want to make it so if they're at my feet, but I can't reach, like I can't look lower, but I'm looking as low as I can to just assume that I want to grab whatever is at my feet. Two batteries, three batteries overall. All right. I'm not sure if there's a downside to me keeping my GUI up, but there doesn't seem to be. So I think I'll just keep it up forever. So where are the green glowing things at? This very much feels like it's going to be a walking simulator style game, which I personally don't have a problem with. I know it's not uh, everybody's favorite genre, but I usually enjoy it because they usually end up having really enriching stories and such. That's an ominous sound. Ah, what have we here? I like the vaulting. The vaulting works pretty well. Is that a green glowing thing? That's a battery. The sound, as nice as it sounds, doesn't really fit the situation, I feel like. I feel like it's it's too upbeat sounding for where I am, you know? It, it feels like, ding! Like it's a happy ding. It's not a, a depressing ding. 
It's not a fearful ding. It's very much a happy ding. Close doors to prevent critters from entering. Is that what that grinding is? I feel like that's what that grinding is. And what that blood splatter is. Sanity is low. That grinding sounds very close. Like, right around that corner close. Like, I should not go that way close. What is that? The sound design, once again, top notch. Wow. It's not in that vent, is it? Oh, why am I why am I approaching the vent? I should not go anywhere near that vent. Looks empty in there. That's what he wants me to think, isn't it? I'm out of sanity pills too. Is it just a broken air circulator? Is that all it is? Oh. This is stressful. What the hell is that sound? Why can't I look at this? It's glowing, right? I should be able to take it? Guess not. Oh, don't eat me, don't eat me, don't eat me. A circuit. A battery. Oh, this thing's almost dead. How do I use the batteries? Ooh, man. That sounds bad. Alright, let's try checking this side again, now that I know what the grinding is. That's right, we'll just go down the hallway. We'll just go down the ominous hallway. I'm not sure what's up with this little glowing spot here. Uh, that was here, I should say, rather. Yeah, what are these glowing spots all about? Maybe that's just my sanity. Oh, uh, this battery's dead. I have no idea how to exchange it. Wait, was there nothing here the whole time? And battery's dead. Yeah, let's walk into the darkness. It looks like I can defend myself to some degree. Alright, I gotta exchange some health for sanity here. Do I have any health packs? No. Oh boy, this is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. What the hell, man? Oh shit. What the hell? Health pack heal. Yeah, that, that's basically what I didn't want. A circuit. So, you're telling me this guy willingly decided to put his bed in some kind of a corridor at the end of a bunch of hallways, and he said, this is where I want to sleep. I want no escape if anything ever goes wrong. That's what this guy said when he set up his bed. Jesus Christ. Oh, please, no monsters. Here, sanity. Sanity sounds great right about now. Health for sanity just sounds wonderful. Oh, Jesus, the lights are on. That can't be good. I'm starting to think those little dots are a symptom of insanity, actually. It's the little... Th Holy fuck. Close the doors. It'll prevent critters from reaching you. I guess I didn't die, so they're not wrong. Jesus, where'd it go? <laughs> not like I have anywhere to run to right now. I don't know if I can get through that, but it might be something I need. Let's see if it crushes. Ooh, yep, it crushes. All right, what's this? V-Ram? V-Ram. Green glowy thing. That's looking good. Jesus. I'm not sure if the batteries are just supposed to automatically apply or what, but I don't seem to... Uh I don't seem to see them just automatically applying. Hmm. 
I wonder what this setting is anyway. It's so futuristic. It feels like almost a spaceship or something. I miss my light. A little more VRAM in the bathroom. What the hell just got me? The fuck was that? What the? Oh, lovely. Little girl singing. Yeah, this bodes well. Wow, that is just so unsettling. Let's just uh, close that door, huh? Just in case there is something around here. Yeah. This game definitely does understand unsettling. It's also a good musical cue right there. Like a really subtle little lull you into a false sense of security tune. It's pretty spot on, actually. Alright, we're going to exchange for some sanity. Screw my health. I like not being insane. Some parts are still missing. Now, is there an inventory or something I don't know about? Hang on. Let's check the controls real quick. Sprint, falls, run. Take A-REM pills. Don't, oh, I think those are probably for... Oh, reload. Okay, there we go. R. R reloads the flashlight batteries. Now we're talking. That's all I needed. Alright, so I've been here. Flashlight is good. Flashlight is life. Flashlight is love. Door is locked. And this is locked until I get the security stuff. So I must have missed something. Something probably obvious. Storage. Oh, God. There's never anything good in storage. Storage is not a place where humans should go. Look, this is door. There's no way that's a good sign. I do like how that, that fan is being... Oh, that's cool. I don't really know where the fan is, but it's probably through there. Yep, I see it now. That's an awesome effect. Storage is not a place for humans. Storage is a place for things. Nothing but the sound of your own little wet footfalls. What in... Fuck... Um, let me in? Let me in, maybe? Um, I am trapped. Is he in there? Or is he just down the hall? I have nowhere else to go. Jesus Christ. Didn't I close that door? And then all the lights came on. That's a good sign. That's a bad sign. Oh, it's the security camera. Whew. Something I can actually quantify. Holy crap. Remember to close the door this time, high sight. Don't let the critters in. Despite their name, they're not as friendly as they sound. What the f Oh god. Sanity, sanity please. More sanity would be good. Interact. Interact, damn you. Alright, one of the batteries. Nothing. Yeah, more sandy pills would be really great right about now. No, some equipment is missing again. Some missing equipment, medical tubes, and other equipment. Dr. Kill's still mad. Can't read all of this. Losing too much time. What's this? Just a light. Nothing. Nothing. Most of these are very empty. 
It's kind of unsatisfying. Alright, I feel like I'm gonna lose all sanity before I even find all these parts. I do like how he forces me to turn my back on the room I just entered by pressing these buttons. That was no mistake, I can tell. That was calculated. I like that. Let's make sure this is closed, huh? Yeah, there we go. Totally back box myself in. Like a genius. Oh, is that what's been beeping? Okay. Something's still missing, but I don't know what parts I have. Let me check the controls again. Reload flashlight, interact, hurt yourself for sanity. Yeah, that makes sense. Switch between items and notes. N. There it is. Okay, so what do I need? Three circuits, four VRAM, two batteries. I have three VRAM, two circuits, and two batteries. So I got the batteries. I need one more VRAM, and I need one more circuit. Wherever that I'm going to find those. Uh, pressing I to bring up an inventory would be a bit easier, I think, and a bit more obvious, you know? That's kind of the standard go-to. What do I have? Oh, the music just got weird and my sanity's low. That's probably no coincidence. Maybe it's something over here I missed. I do like how my own buddy body covers up light. That's pretty cool. Is there anything in here, maybe? Nothing. Oh. Nope. Grab it. Dang it. Look down further. Circuit. Yes. That means just one more VRAM, right? Now, I'm wondering how much health is going to come into play in this. Am I actually going to be, like, fighting? Or is it a question of, like, things falling on me or something? Because I don't know if I'd, I'd want fighting in this game. Seems like sanity alone should be enough, and uh, basically that should just be all pill-based. But I mean, that's just from what I've seen so far. I don't really know how it's going to go in the long run, you know? Talk down. Hmm. Yeah, this was the blocked-out room. I don't know if there was ever anything actually in here that I needed. Just missing one VRAM, right? Three circuits, four VRAM, two batteries. Yep. One VRAM. Well, I'm running low on health. This is very creepy. The developer has done a great job of creating a very uh, open-ended fear system here. <laughs> it's a good horror setup. Okay, shouldn't have gone that way. But unfortunately, a lot of it is time-based. The, the sanity feels more like a timer than anything else. And uh, that, that's kind of unfortunate, you know? It should feel more like something that's lost for certain reasons. Right now, it's really just something that's lost because time is passing. Am I in the ceiling or something? Okay, never mind. I think I'm just going so insane that I don't feel like I'm walking right. Yep, that's exactly what it is, actually. So yeah, I'm, I'm not quite sure if I'm buying the whole sanity in this sense. It, it feels much more like a timer, and that's kind of a waste of the sanity system, in my opinion. I, I would like it a lot more if the sanity was actually based on... Like, I'm, I'm witnessing something like a dead body or something, or uh, I visibly see a creature. I visibly see something that can kill me. That would obviously be something to drive me insane. But it seems like creatures only come out when your sanity is a certain level, you know? And I, I can't look at this, whatever it is. And I think I already grabbed the only thing that was here. But the vibe downright perfect. I, I will not deny that for a second. My sanity is almost gone, so I just I might as well use my... I can't, I'm too low on health now to get more sanity out of it, unfortunately. So I'm pretty screwed now, unless I find more pills or... Let's see. Freely share, off day, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, unless I find the last VRAM that's hiding somewhere... I don't know if you really want to make a scavenger hunt out of this game, especially if you're timing me, which, again, sanity meter equals timer right now. So that, that's kind of a dangerous game, really. Uh, where the heck?
heck is the last VRAM? I must have walked right by it at some point. I do like how running is only really a downside in the sense that it screws with your vision. That's pretty solid, actually. Alright, I'm about to hit single digit sanity. There we go, black and white mode. Maybe that'll help me find it. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably gonna die of sanity loss. And that that's really a shame. That's really the best way I could describe it as a shame. I I would really have thought a sanity system would be more based around the concept of, you know, you're you're seeing things you shouldn't see or uh or something along those lines, but instead it really is just a timer, and that's unfortunate to say the least. Maybe it was in the original room I started at, maybe I just didn't look hard enough. It's gonna be hard to tell now, I'm kind of kind of screwed myself. Cause I don't really, I can't see. Hmm. Yep, I'm screwed. Unless, did I open this place up? Nope. Maybe I missed it in storage. Won't matter in a second. Now, I'm sure there's a reason behind me losing sanity over time, as opposed to just, you know, based on actual events happening. I'm sure there's, like, you know, probably a story reason. These critters or something or other. other. Was it down here? I'll bet it was in the storage room. There was a lot of boxes and such there. Oh, wait. Is this, like, a door? Can I open this? Nope. I can't open this. That requires a level 2 key card. Plus, it looks radioactive as hell, so... Probably not smart either way. And the light is out. Sanity's at 5%. Hey, color's back! That's good, right? That can only be good. Why else would they give me color back? Unless they want me to see the color red. Can I just sack some sanity... some health already for my sanity? So I'm being held up completely by one missing item. It's kind of a shame. I wonder how far back I'm going to have to respawn when I die, because I die when I hit 0% sanity, so even if I found it now, I don't think I can get back in time. Yeah, that's going to be it. It's probably going to be a gruesome death, too. I assume a critter's going to come and, like, bite my head off or something. Error, 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 no kidding. Yeah, the game definitely has some solid ideas, and it's it had some cool sanity effects even, uh, with the little kids singing and everything. I assume that was, uh, scripted, but it could have also been, like... Oh, wait a minute, don't tell me. There it is. Does that up my sanity at all? Do I get anything back for all that? Nope. Nothing. That sucks. Oh well. Let's see if I can at least make it through the door before I die. Open up, says I. Oh, that didn't work. What, did I have to interact with it again? Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. It's these doors, right? Nope, still locked. Oh, it's this one. 1% sanity, not even. Find me some pills or something. Any pills in here? I'm just trying to get in. Just want to run in. Nope, that's not opening. How about here? Oh, come on, there's got to be pills. You have to reward pills for something like this. That's a coffee burn. Ugh. Yep, I'm screwed. And that's how High Sight died. That's too bad. Oh, there they were. I think those were pills. <laughs> oh, God damn it. Yeah, I, I feel like I don't like the idea of the sanity being nothing but a death timer. It feels like a total waste of it. Uh, how much sanity do I have? 
Oh, they did not give me any extra sanity. So basically, this game can absolutely have uh, failure states where you just flat out die. Uh, and then you respawn. But you respawn with the same stuff you had. So basically, you could find yourself in a situation where you'll just be dying infinitely. Like, this is actually really close to one of those situations. It might actually be if this aren't, isn't actually sanity pills. There they are. There we go. I got one sanity out of that. Did I get any sanity out of that? What did I just pick up? I don't think I actually got any sanity worth talking about from that. Yeah, I'm getting, like, no sanity off of these pills. I'm screwed! I'm not even getting a full percent. Look. It's 0.35%? That might be a bug. That must be a bug. I can't imagine that being anything but a bug. I was getting way more sanity before. Seems like you get uh, poor returns after a while, don't you? Chamber unlocked. Find your way out of the facility. I'm not going to have time. Maybe if I rush it, I'll have enough time, but I feel like that's not going to happen. Come on, open. You work now. You too, open. And I'm dead. Yeah, that is really a shame. I really wish that the sanity was more than just a death timer, but that's all it's coming up as, and that is really un- Now I'm gonna chalk it up being a bug. I'm gonna chalk it up being a bug that I keep on uh, getting like little sanity out of these pills, like minimal sanity. Next to none, even. To the point where it's not even really worth taking them. Yeah, well, right now my sanity is at the lowest it can get, and I'm not getting like any adverse side effects. I thought I'd be getting like sound effects and stuff, but nothing. Or at least I'm up to 2% this time. 3%. And was that all I get? Grab the flashlight battery. Alright, there we go. Run, 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 run. Before I lose my sanity. Wait, is running decreasing my sanity more? No, I think it's actually the sound. At this point, if I wanted to play it, I think I'd have to just completely restart because there's no way for me to uh, proceed much further, it seems. that door. Sanity stuff in here, please. What do you got for me? Pills. All I need is a pill. Nope. Can't, can't read your shit. Don't have time. Pills. Pills anywhere. I'm going insane. <laughs> Insanity. It's a feature. Pills anywhere. Are you serving pills for breakfast? Maybe some health. Health would be great. Convert those into pills. Literally just drain it out of my blood. Yeah, awesome sound effect. Not what I need right now. Need pills. That is a really solid sound effect, though. Very alarming. Pills! Pills this way! Oh, the worst door in the world right here. Seriously, just let me through. Okay, how about you? Ah, uh, death by door. It's a feature. Oh, well, well, that's really as far as I can look into this game right now. It definitely looks like it has a lot of promise, but the whole death timer thing is just... It's killing it for me, honestly. That is... Uh, sanity was so much cooler when it was messing with me, but all it's doing here is just... Killing me. Uh, it, it feels like a waste, honestly. 0% sanity should be more of a... Uh, more of a feeling of dread. More of a feeling of everything is out to kill me, but instead... It literally does just kill you. Maybe if 0% sanity didn't kill you, but just made everything around you much more, like, harder to navigate, and health was the only way to kill you, I think that'd be a lot better, but... Let's see, it looks like I can select stages. Can I, uh... That's still the research lab. I'm gonna pretend that I was near the end of the research lab and see if I can join the, uh... Engine facility? No? Oh, I have to actually unlock it. Damn. So I would be starting from scratch again, wouldn't I? Yeah. Well, it's, it's a real shame. It really is. I do think this game has a lot of potential. I do think, uh... It has a lot of great ideas, but as it is right now, I just, uh, I can't call it playable, so... Look at that, I'm starting with 1% sanity again. How'd that happen? I'm just starting now. Why, why, why? Why, game? I have no health either, so I can't, uh, sack it. I think that's a bug. I'm calling it, it's a bug. It's gotta be a bug. Oh, well, it is what it is, and what it is right now is just not quite working out. 
But, ladies and gentlemen, this is demented. It really does have some really solid ideas, and I think the developer can build on these beautiful. Oh, it loaded the save state, I think. So the stage just starting me out over in a different place. Okay, anyways, I was saying, this is demented. Really solid ideas, but I think it needs to relook at its, uh, its main mechanic of killing you through sanity. I think that is one thing that is not going to fly in the long run. But it definitely does have the horror concept down, and it definitely has the horror feel down, and I'm really excited to see more of it down the line. Demented, everybody. Go check it out.